Yep. Giddy up. See it? Ain't no good in worrying about what may be. Worry about what you got and ain't got, and none of you got nothing to worry about. Just like my daddy told me. He said, son, don't worry about the future. Worry about today. And I said, what do you mean, Pa? He said, well, you're gonna get a beating so hard you'll be lucky to even see tomorrow. <laughs> he was right. Damn nearly killed me, but it taught me not to watch women in the outhouse and get caught. It also taught me not to worry about nothing other than that which is gonna happen. <sighs> Wait there, Arthur. You like the new camp, Reverend? Oh, yes. We moved, didn't we? God help us. That's deep, Uncle. I speak only the truth. Well, that's one lie right there. Anyway, I won't disturb you. Yep, yep. Okay, Arthur. You okay with this spot for now, Mr. McGuire? Ah, oh, sure. I like to keep moving, I do. It's in me blood. Along with a lot of whiskey. Yes, kid. You got a lot on? How are you doing? Ah, uh, just hunting for all this hillbilly gold that Dutch and Hosea seem to think is out there just waiting to be stolen. <laughs> Why? I got something. Could be good. Yeah? Yeah, I was in Rhodes talking to some of the colored folk. They said there's a gang of fools holed up in the swamps east of here who think their war ain't never ended. The Civil War? Yeah, apparently it's still raging in these fools' minds 30 years later. Okay. That ain't my point. These ignorant fools are weapon dealers. And in their dealings, sometimes sit on a decent pile of cash. Yeah, been selling weapons to Cuba and South America for years. Anyway, the old boy I was talking to reckoned there might be a bunch of cash just sitting around. And failing that? Maybe a nice stash of weapons. With just a bunch of crazies guarding it? Exactly. Well, worth taking a look at least, isn't it? That was my thinking. 
Said it was at some place called Shady Bear, deep in the woods. Okay. <laughs> All right then, let's go rob some food. met these crazies before. You been drinking again? No. Well, yes, but no, that's not how I might have met them. I think some of them harangued me and Sadie when we were coming back with supplies. Mrs. Adler? Yeah. And Mrs. Adler did just fine. More than fine, actually. She's terrified. But I got a notion these fellers is one and the same. Yeah, we won't find no shortage of angry Peckerwood idiots in the state of Lamorne. That's for sure. Is it really that different in this state? We haven't come far. It seems like it is. These boys got a manner about them, but I haven't necessarily noticed. All respect, Mr. Morgan. You wouldn't notice. Might call you a nigger lover. They see us riding like this. But most of it is a... A glance or a word. And after that, a visit in the night. Well, out west is... Out west is out west. And you're all who you are. Right. Decent folks. But some places down here, they judge differently. Well, I don't know. Guess it can't be so easy for you, Lenny. I'm sorry you're caught up in this. Well... I guess their gold still shining, and their guns still shoot. <laughs> so I'm game for robbing any and every one of these bastards for all they got. <laughs> okay then. Plus, it beats being lynched back in Blackwater with all of you by my side. I guess it does. Feels like we're close. It's a rundown old plantation house down in the bayou somewhere. Let's take it slow. Be cautious. If, like you say, these crazies are sitting on weapons, we're gonna want to strategize a little before getting shot at. <laughs> of course. They said find the old battlefield and keep on going. Yeah, I've been here before. I can see the wrecked old Civil War weaponry. Where are the wrecked old Civil War holdouts? See that church up ahead? They're supposed to use it as an outpost. Heard they got men going between here and the big house all day. Okay. Look at this field. <laughs> Imagine getting caught up in a fight like this. Yeah, I don't care to. Hold those reins in. Let's just take a look around the place. I hear you. Uh, it doesn't look like anyone's here. We don't know that for sure. Let's have us a nosy. 